Hello, this is Dr. Deep Datta. I am an endocrinologist based in Dwarka, New Delhi. Today we are going to discuss about the top 5 cheapest and highly effective generic anti-diabetes medications which are available for use in India. So let's start with the first medicine. It belongs to the class of sulfonylureas. These are medicines which promote insulin release from our pancreas and are highly effective in type 2 diabetes. So the first medicine is the tablet Glipizide. It's a generic medicine. It comes at 5 mg tablet. The dose per day is decided by your endocrinologist which can range from 5 to 25 milligrams per day and the cost of a single tablet is less than one rupee it's around 70 to 80 paise per tablet so even if i am taking say 15 milligrams of glipizide per day my daily cost of therapy would be less than three rupees and then we can calculate the monthly cost of therapy would it would be around 100 Indian rupees or less. The second cheapest medicine in this line would be another sulfonylurea which is glibenclamide. This is a very old medicine in use for last 30 years. It's a very potent medicine. It also promotes insulin release from pancreas. Again, let your endocrinologist decide the dose. The daily dose can vary between 5 to 15 milligrams per day and a single tablet of glibenclamide, which is also known as gliburide, uh, cost around 1 rupee 10 pesa in India. So if I am taking 10 milligrams of glibenclamide in a day, my daily cost of therapy would be only around 2 rupees and my monthly cost of therapy would be hardly around 60 to 65 Indian rupees per month. The third medicine among the top five cheapest medicine would be metformin. Now metformin is the first line agent for the treatment of diabetes recommended by all guidelines across the world including the Indian diabetes guidelines. The daily dose of metformin as decided by your endocrinologist would vary anywhere between 500 milligrams per day to 2 grams per day. Now the cost of a single tablet of metformin of 1000 mg or 1 gram is ranges between 2 to 3 Indian rupees. So if I am taking around 2000 mg of metformin which is the full dose of metformin my daily cost of therapy would be less than around 6 rupees per day. So the monthly cost of therapy comes to only around 180 Indian rupees in a month. The fourth medicine among the top five cheapest medicine is pioglitazone. Now this is an, another very old, a very effective anti-diabetes medication. It makes the insulin which forms in our body naturally work better. It's an insulin sensitizer. The recommended doses in the Indian population and best decided for you by your endocrinologist would be 15 to 30 milligrams per day. A single tablet of pioglitazone 15 milligrams cost around 5 to 6 Indian rupees. So if I am taking 30 milligrams of pyoglitazone in a day, my daily cost of therapy would be around 10 Indian rupees, which comes to around 300 Indian rupees per month. And the fifth and the last most cheapest anti-diabetic medications among so many available uh, for clinical use in the Indian market would be the generic Wildagliptin. Yes, now Wildagliptin has gone off patent and the, we have generic Wildagliptin available from different manufacturers. A cost of a 50 milligram tablet comes around 5 Indian rupees. So if I am taking the full dose of Wildagliptin, which is 100 milligrams per day, that would come around 10 Indian rupees per day. Again, 300 Indian rupees in a month. So. I have just discussed with you five of very effective 
and the most cheapest anti-diabetes medications available in the Indian market. They are all scheduled H drug. So sit down and discuss with your endocrinologist and let your doctor decide what is best for you. Take care.